Right guys, today's video is all about these service manuals, which I think are invaluable for someone who's doing like chainsaws up, strimmers up, uh, mowers, anything, even if you're just fixing your own stuff, or we've got a small little, little side business, uh, repairing stuff for people. Most of you know about these then if you are more professionally into it. But they, they're really invaluable, like I said, they're worth getting. It's the chainsaw one. We'll try to keep it under the light, yeah? It's a bit uh, dark. Only thing is, they're old. They only go up through 1998. But be honest with you, the basics and the principles of a two-stroke engine and chainsaws and everything haven't changed over the years. Other than the, the electronic stuff now and the later stuff, yeah? The Autotune and M-Tronic. The, the Ascaran Autotune, still M-Tronic. But you're not really worried about that. Most people, it's just the basics of carburetors, like coils, um, just pistons, putting everything back together. And it, these will cover it, because the basics haven't changed. The principles are all the same. So I, I don't know if this is at a later date. There might be another book out after this one. It's the 10th edition. It is actually 2009 book. November 2009, even though they only cover that, them dates. But there's all the makes you do. They cover a lot of stuff, normal stuff, Ask Rana, John said, some strange stuff that's no longer about. Good if you're into your old vintage uh, equipment or chainsaws. Pioneer Partner, obviously still, you got Red Max, Shindawa, um, Echo. But what I like as well, it gives you a lot of stuff on, on how to sharpen chains, it gives you all the information there. How to get a tension, the, the chain tension. I was writing stuff in there as well, like, as soon as I do my course. Just uh, different types of uh, the chisel, chisel and chipper. Different tooth like. So, anyway, there's lots of stuff in here. Carburetor for servicing carburetors. Uh, all the different makes. Tillotson, the good carburetor. The Irish carburetor there, aren't they? It just really, really gives you a lot of in-depth information. There we are, I must be looking for a kit for something for there. That's the different things you can buy. The gauges, they're on eBay there. For measuring the... The, um, the metering unit. That's for measuring that. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna to get one of them. I've got to be honest. But like I said, they're just... Isn't that, see them measuring there? Anyway. Really, really helpful stuff. And if you say, well, all right, it's out of date, let's go to Ask Varna. I've used this many a time because, like I said, they haven't changed that much. Um, all the basics are the same. If you wonder, you can't go far wrong. And there's older models, like a, say I was doing a 372. Well, if I looked for an older one, like a, a 262, here we are, 262 XP. Oh no, sorry, I want a 272, don't I? So look, move up a little bit more. Or 394, it's a bigger than eh? Just the, the principles are the same. That's a big 3120 XP, that's still out there now. That shows he's old school. John said, which basically, you know, that's Rana's. Anyway, there's lots and lots of information here. I think it's only like 10, 15 quid. Makita. Massey Ferguson, they must put their name on someone else's saw. McCullough, lots of stuff. Really, really handy, helpful for someone, like I said, who's into this stuff. I think this was a deer, that's one, well, you see the thickness of it. You know what I mean? Compared to the lawnmower, when he's twice the thickness, I'd say. There's the trimmer one, I haven't really done that much with these two, mostly with this one. But they're still handy. Let me put this on the. Uh, oh, yeah, a minute. So this is the trimmer one. Um, second edition. Well, maybe there's different different editions out there. I think they do other ones as well, like Ride on Mower. They all the same make. Intertech. I think that was an earlier one. And then they went to Clumma. Cloyma. Pro series. But you can see it's basically it is the same make. 
I've got to stick, it is, and I'm into, they must have changed. But Intertech are good, because I've got tractor stuff for them. Anyway, let's look at the makes of the, and I keep getting as many of these as I can. They're really, really handy. There's the makes again. You know, your Robin, Kaz, uh, everything. It's all, yeah? John Bunton. I didn't even know Bunton done that. Uh, and they call him in a minute. Like trimmer, string trimmer. But anyway. Same again. Old fashioned stuff. In the beginning, what they show. It even tells you the right ways to stand, your stance. Everything. Different types. Different blades. Just really, really good information. Um, like problems, like troubleshooting problems. It's all there. Um, John Deere. Off coat, never heard of it. Olympic. Like I said, a lot of old stuff in this one. Still. Chindawa. But like I said, it's all... It's all the same. The principles haven't changed. Mitsubishi, little TG26. It's a good engine. But they're all good engines. Anyway, really, really handy. I've got to be honest with this one there. Anyway, on to the last one now. This is like brand new. I haven't done much of at all of this. The fifth edition. Maybe there's more again. But well, that's an oldish mower on there. It does say 2009 on the last uh, print, but there we are, we've got Bollands, Craftsman, Bunton again, Cub Cadet, John Deere, a lot of American stuff, yeah, Honda, Homelite, Askvana, Lone Boy, which a lot of stuff will do the Toro stuff as well there, eh? over oh, I can see of it, we've got Toro, um, it's, it's a lot of good stuff there, Murray, and then all the engine manufacturers, Biggs and Stratton, let's, let's be fair, there's so much information on that in this book. Yeah, it's a great information there. Eh? Different parts, what they called. Troubleshooting. You see all right there? Eh? And all the um, carburetor service. Biggs and Stratton. Oh, two stroke. I've never seen a two stroke Biggs and Stratton. Honest though. But your normal except the quantum Europa and Vanguard there. But this you fair, a lot of this stuff you can take through to like classic bigs. All our stuff, the same setup there, what I can see there. Just really, really handy. And there's your quantum engine there then. I tell you what, really, really good book. Europa. I never seen one of them ones, I don't know what engine that is. As you can see, it's brand new. I haven't even looked at this one yet. Um, different model numbers, eh? I don't know what that means, but... Lawn Boy. Anyway, Kabuta. Kabuta. But it's Andy. Andy Dwyer. We're going to get more of them, like I said. Tecumseh to to 2-stroke. Tecumseh 4-stroke. Also, they got a Suzuki in here, the Toro. Which is Andy. And the Kawasaki, self-propelled drive, all about uh, self-propelled, eh? There's a Toro one, I'm sure what I mean. Toro, well, that's the Suzuki. Two-stroke Suzuki, three and a half horsepower. That's a small Suzuki, like the MX120. Yeah, 121cc. So that's the MX120 there. Eh? I don't know if they do the 5.5 horsepower one, which I got. They do a full horsepower, I think that's a four stroke one. Oh, two stroke. Anyway, really, really handy, that's all I'd show it. So, this, I think they do different types as well for like ride on mowers. But, um, handy to have. Like I said, so let's pass that on. If someone's uh, doing this as an hobby or profession, anything like that or just if you see the model that you want that you got and you think oh, I could do a service manual on it um, just get it for that it's well worth it all right so just like pass the information on me eh? but they do these good service books 
it's very helpful been helpful to me so please like and subscribe thanks for watching cheers